Ryder, speak. Speak. Ryder, speak. Almost. Speak. Oh, so close. Speak. Speak. Almost. One more time. Speak. Okay, very good. Yeah, I've had Ryder for um, about three and a half years. Uh, we got him when he had just been released uh, from being a service dog, so he's a retired service dog. Um, he went through the Hearts of Gold program and was trained and placed in the service and they uh, discovered a heart murmur and so he had to retire from service uh, and I was able to adopt him and now he serves as the Davis College therapy dog. So he comes with me to work every day as long as I'm in town and um, he comes in the morning and makes his rounds. He mostly spends the mornings interacting with uh, other employees that, that work in, in the Dean's office. So absolutely favorite part is the uh, effect he has on uh, people that visit, either people that are just visiting uh, the university, maybe thinking about coming to school here, or they're here uh, professionally, you know, to visit, uh, to give a lecture. Um, and then of course our students uh, that come and see him. There's a lot of students that miss their pets from home um, and it's, it's nice for folks to be able to come and, you know, get all the positive benefits that come from having uh, animals around. And, of course, we are uh, a college that, that loves its animals, whether they're farm animals or wildlife. Uh, so it's perfect to have a dog like Ryder uh, for our students.